Hi everyone. Finally got it going. Welcome to Lin Fun Art by Linda. I haven't done any in a while on video, but I have been painting lots. I'm getting ready for my first craft fair, craft show, November 26th at Riverside School here in Prince Albert. Uh, it's a Saturday, 9 till 4. Pretty excited for it. Uh, my son is going to be my sidekick. So I've been experimenting and playing and trying some new color schemes. This is a gorgeous one, but it cracked. And this is just a little frig fridge magnet on a canvas. So I'm a little disappointed with that. So I'm going to try and fix them and see if I can get it going. But I found some ideas from uh, YouTube. Uh, some of the artists have been using these color to go. Sherwin Williams and I picked this up at the Sherwin Williams store in Saskatoon I know not in Prince Albert sue me <laughs> uh, but this color is tricorn black I'm gonna give black a try today and then I also got another one and it is in Moscow midnight wait till you see this color look at that is that my color or what <laughs> I can't wait to try that. Of course, I do too many blues, but I'm sorry. That's me. I love blues. So today I thought, well, I'm going to give it a whirl on a couple coasters first with the black. And not these colors. I'm going to put those to bed for a little while. Time out. See if I can figure that out. I am going to try some different colors. I've got... Uh, deco art, very berry, uh, folk art, raspberry flash, a custom purple, uh, deco art, plum, ball gown, I've got an interference gold, interference violet, and a gold. Craft Smart, radiant gold, my favorite gold. So, here we go. I'm going to try and get some on onto a coaster here. Hopefully not be so messy. My, it's messy. It's really runny. Could be having some issues with this. We'll see. Really runny. Probably put way too much on here. Well, I know I put too much on here, so I'm just going to run some of it down. And you know how nice black is in your kitchen or dining room or on your table. It's like, oof, mess. There, I think that should be good. Now everything is going to be black. Ugh. Can't really see me doing this. I'm scared to move the... <laughs> Maybe I'll just move over a bit. Instead of trying to move that. Okay, a little better. Oh, black everywhere. Okay, you're in view anyway. So we're gonna try the plum first, I think. Nice cat hair, of course. Not gonna go too big. Looks gorgeous on the black. A little interference. Violet. Oops, of course. 
and then the custom burpa. And interference gold. And raspberry flash, I think. And then, I think I've got all the colors I want on there. That one doesn't pop the bubbles as good as this guy. And black and white cell activator. My go-to, I use Australian Floetrol, three to one, on Oxide Black and Titanium White, both Amsterdam. So let's go the white first, I think. Okay, nice drop. And then the black. There we go. Oh, that purple takes over so much. Watching the cell action. Lots of it. Wow. Pretty nice. Can you see that? The cells formed really fast. Slow spin at first. I can't believe how fast the cells showed up on that. Other way balancing it out looks like it's spinning so much up there but it's just spinning slowly hmm I can go a little faster now still had too much pillow Wow Now my uh, spinner is going to end up all black, but that's why I didn't change it. I have a new shower cap to put on. Little things you find at the dollar store. How's that looking? Hmm. Just tilting it, centering it. Not much movement on there, which surprises me. Not crazy about it, but the colors are pretty good. Maybe I used too much color and it's definitely blingy. I think I'll take it off. Bring it up. Do you have any bubbles? 
no bubbles bring it up close to you how's that look to you that's all right eh? I think should we try the black with some blue oh you know I'm going to hmm I'm not sure about how I feel about this one not going anywhere though Okay, let's get the blue. I think I'm just going to do less. Okay. But I have all my go-to colors already. But I don't think I'm going to use black. I think I'm going to use white just to see the differences. Peeling off off of my creamer bottle from molding my pillow. I use uh, Glidden Semi Gloss uh, Premium and Titanium. Well, I guess it's just white. hope it works so much white <laughs> so much black everywhere I think maybe that's why I had trouble on those uh, little word uh, canvases those magnets mini canvases I'm just uh, spreading it out so it's got somewhere to go when I put the paints on and spin. There we go. Lots of bubbles. See what I mean? Oh, I just pop away that I see them. Know how else to get them. I mean, they pop pretty fast. sticks for the blues this uh, turquoise pigment that I is my favorite I think it's done yeah it's done maybe I can get a little out of it but there's not much left and it was amazing color it reminded me of sea glass TLP Okay, I think I got it. Let's see? I think I got enough for two. Oh, I'll be lucky. Okay, then I'm going to put my custom blue, which I love. I did such a good job on this one. And over top of this light pigment, it just glows, eerie. Okay. And then liquid text, cobalt turquoise, gorgeous color. 
I love it. I love layering in that one for the last, for the gorgeous selves, but not this time. Okay. And then another custom teal, blue, acrylic, black, silver, and turquoise green. We go over these colors all the time. Because I have the most success with these. Okay, Amsterdam turquoise green is the last one. Looks a little thick. And all I do is use uh, Minmax Polycrylic just to thin it out a touch. It's already mixed with my pouring medium, which is Bare 8300, the base C, and the Polycrylic. And I use three to one. And it usually thins it out pretty good, but just a touch to thin this paint out now. All right. So that's got all of those. Let's put some cell activator and see what we get. Uh, Tantidium white, Amsterdam, and again oxide black, Amsterdam. Okay, here comes the magic. Phenomenal. Just centering the bloom. Look at that. And the cells are coming like crazy. Watching that. I'm just blowing on the black a little bit. See if I can get it to open up. And it's coming together. Coming together nicely. Unfortunately, I got some white. So that means I must have blown down into the pillow. I don't like those too much. So I just kind of hide them a bit. A little bit of balance. There, that looks pretty good. Let's see how it spins out. like that black and white. No color underneath it is what happened. A little faster. Just about there. I have trouble going the other way always. Okay. Pretty cool. Just got a little bit of a corner left here. 
I don't know how to get that off. Just about there. I don't want to make this too long. It's already 20 minutes. All the edges are covered. That was a good one. How's that? Happy with that. Any movement? Oh yeah, I got him a little bit still. One more. Uh, it's really confusing to see all that black spinning on there, sorry. <laughs> a little better. I'll take it. But I always have success with these colors. Strange as it is. And again, the pillow is working fine. So what the heck? I don't know. I got a bubble here. Oh, I made it worse. Wrong one to use. There we go. Kind of hit it. Yeah, I like that. What do you guys think? I think it turned out pretty good considering. All right. So that was a short one <laughs> for me, 20 minutes. Um, glad you came and got to witness me do some. Uh, come back again. I am going to work on my channel and get more subscribers. So if you like this video, hit the like button, hit subscribe and share it with your friends. Uh, I appreciate all the critique and I appreciate everybody always popping in and checking to see what I'm up to. I promise I will work at doing more. Thanks for stopping by. Bye all.